How's it going everyone, and welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, I'll be teaching you guys how to manually add a PTR or a pointer record in Cloudflare. So this applies to the domains as well as the websites registered under your Cloudflare account. So without further ado, let's dive right in. So the first thing that we're going to do here is obviously we're going to log into our Cloudflare account as an administrator. So we want to navigate to the dashboard and we want to look for the domain or the website that we want to add a PTR a PTR record to or a DNS uh, PTR. So in this case, um, to navigate to that, we want to go to websites. So let's pretend that I want to add a PTR record to this. So um, simply want to click on it like so. And it's actually wait for it to load. So um, I don't actually have the plan set up for uh, this website, but once you guys are here, you will click on DNS and then you want to go to records. Now, um, here's where you guys actually add, get to add a PTR record or a pointer record. So normally you would search for um, the DNS records that aren't taken yet. So let's, let's do um, 149.168.1.1 port 992.9992. Actually, let's do 8000 instead. Search, see if it's taken. Okay, so it's not taken. So we get actually get to add the record to our website. So you get to configure and um, input this record into uh, the website. And yeah, you successfully added a PTR record to your website in Cloudflare. So if it's not taken, you guys can simply click on add record and that'd be it. So hopefully this video helped you guys out. And if it did, be sure to let us know down in the comment section below. And if you guys want to see more videos like these, we do have a YouTube channel where we do guides like these daily. So if you guys want to show your support that, you can do so by subscribing to the channel. So with all that said, thank you all for watching, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.